Howdy everybody and welcome to the first episode of my uh, new series I'm starting on the World of Solitude server. Yeah buddy, yeah, yeah, I'm starting two things in the same week. Yeah, that's the thing I'm doing. But, you know, I do what I can. So, I got invited to come play on here and here I am. I finally found me a place I like. Uh, I walked around a bit and found this really cool little area here. I'm digging it. I've got plans for it. I got plans. This is where I think we're going to be doing a, a, a harbor, a sky harbor for uh, airships. Um, but right now, uh, uh, you know, it's new for me. I'm brand new on the server. I have nothing. I have nothing. I was gifted some armor and uh, some diamonds and uh yeah uh, i i went ahead and started a bit been on here a little while getting some stuff set up uh i really don't know what all this is going to look like yet oh no you don't oh no you don't oh he killed one of my sheeps all right i'm gonna have to double wall this i guess ah uh, phooey phooey oh well We'll, we'll fix that in a minute. So here I got me some sheep and some cows and some chickens. And down in there is, is my mine and then my super drop. So, you know, it ain't pretty, but it'll get there. You know, I'm just trying to get stuff sorted out and set up and get started. Got me a little bit of wheat back there. So we'll get there. It's a process, you know, the early grind. Um... Since there's not a whole lot to see here, and uh, some of you folks may not may not be too familiar with the world of solitude, I thought I might pop on over to spawn and take a bit of a walk around. Let's give everybody a chance to chance to see what what's going on here. I also want to show you my spot I picked out for my spawn house. But yeah, isn't this pretty? I love this. I love this. All right, so we're going to hop in a boat. I don't have another portal set up yet. And we're going to head on over to spawn. So give me just a minute and uh, we'll be right there. Yeah, here we are. Check out this cool looking spawn sculpture. That is great. I love it. But yeah, we're here at spawn. Now... They gave me a tour, Sweeney and Spiral and them, uh, but I've slept since then, <laughs> which means that I don't remember hardly nothing. Um, but this is where this is where things are, and I'm still learning who is who and and what's what. So uh, you know, I can't really say, well, this is so and so's, but there are some really great and I great builds over here and i hope i'm not spoiling anything i don't think i am but if i am i'm sorry and i will try and avoid that in the future at the moment i really don't know what has been here for a while and what hasn't so uh this this here is spawn and my plan for my little place is right up there yeah, I like to build in the air, in the sky, up on a mountain top. So my plan is to come on up here and build me a little house. Let's get up here. I haven't, I know kind of what I'm wanting to build, but I don't know the specifics yet. But look at that view. I think it's probably going to be the main floor, main area is going to be here. And I'm going to try and build within the terrain as opposed to tearing it down. You know, work with what's here. I think uh, Spruce Haven is that way. I've not really visited there. Um, but yeah, look at this. This is going to be a great view up here. And uh, there, I think the idea is to try and stay kind of within the Tudor style. For this area but uh and, and i think i can do that and still still really kind of show you know do do my thing uh which i don't i don't often build in tutor style 
Um, in fact, I'm not sure I ever have really. So that's going to be fun. Uh, try and kind of put my twist on a, on a Tudor style house. And then I'm also probably going to need some way of, of accessing it. So I'll probably need to, to do some terraforming a bit. But yeah, they got lots of cool stuff going on over here. I don't even know what all, but I will learn. I will figure it out. I am reckon that's probably an iron farm. <laughs> uh, definitely looks like an iron farm. Uh-oh, it's getting dark. I brought me a bed. Because I knew I'd be out and about and running around, and since I don't really know where stuff is, I don't know what's safe. But if I remember correctly... Let me think here. I'm going to have to think if I. That's always touchy. Is it this way? No. I think this goes to the shopping district. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I've not really fully explored. Like I said, uh, I got a little tour. and uh, But I, I remember vaguely stuff. And I think... This is the shopping district. So we got us a slime, a slime shop, slime stacks. I'll need to come and get some of those later. Books are us. <laughs> Very cool. Very cool. I love it. That's our, that's, that's really neat. Um, let's see. I think there's another portal over here. A deep, scary hole. Let's, let's not fall in there. Um, I don't know what some of this stuff is. There's slabs and such on the ground. Oh, I'm reckoning that's going to soon be a uh, an easier way up, which I guess I probably ought to take it, right? That makes sense to me. Let's get on up here. and Yeah, there's another portal over there. I don't even know what this stuff is. That's all right. I don't need to. I'll figure it out. It'll. Uh, that looks like a kelp and coral farm. Nice. Very cool. I like it. And I think there's another portal. Let's go take a peek and look. See over here. It looks like I think somebody's been moving some villagers about. Um, I don't know how to get in there. I guess we just do that. Let's do that. Let's check out the net. I don't. Yeah. Oh. Hello. We have visitors. All right. So everything is that way. And Takir's tunnels are that way. Storybook Village, I'm guessing that is not to be looked upon yet. What's going on around here? Let's run down here to everything. I don't know what an everything looks like. I don't know what's up there. Let's go this way. Let's fast forward. Well, as it turns out, the everything that I could find, it looked like somebody's personal private build, their base and stuff. So I'm not going to show it because I don't know what's okay to show and what's not yet. Um, so I'm thinking we're going to go back to my base and get to doing some work, get some things done. So tell you what. Let's, uh, oh, I hope he doesn't run away. Okay, he's safe now. All right, yeah, so I will meet you guys back at base, and uh, we'll get some chores done over there. And here we come in. Ain't that pretty? I like it. I like it a lot. I think uh, 
it's we're, I'm going to incorporate all three of these into the overall design but hadn't got there yet I still got many things to build and acquire before I do that so I'm, I'm kind of in the in the get everything set up oh it's pretty though yeah I gotta dig a hole and chop some trees and raise some sheep and cows and such so I can have all the things that I need but uh, I do need to now that I think about it I need to go into the nether and grab me some soul sand so I can oh yeah we'll go this way for now I got me a super drop um, but I could use some soul sand to build me a little bubble waiter but here's where I'm starting out I'm going to set up a a uh, main room get this dug out and built to a way that's going to be weird but I think kind of cool and then I'll start I'll start doing proper branch mining I like to set up a like a like a central hub that has all my things normally if no one's ever going to see it it's just going to be it's just a, a square room with some stuff but since it's potentially going to be seen by people, theoretically, you guys, <laughs> I, you know, I kind of want my hub, my, uh, my mine shaft hub to, to be interesting, be a little more interesting. But uh, I got a ways yet to go. I got to dig a big hole and all I've got is just a normal old pick that's uh, half used up. Yeah, about half. So I need to, uh, I need an enchanting station and some levels so I can get me some efficiency. I think I'm going to build me up a, uh, an AFK fishing hole because that's a good way to get levels and stuff um, when I'm away because I got, I got stuff to do today and uh, like real life stuff, stuff gets in the way. Of the important things like Minecraft. <laughs> uh, so yeah. Let me. Uh, where would I put it. If I had one. I feel like. That might could be my first. Overworld build. Build me a little uh, a fishing shack. That kind of has a view. That would be interesting. Hmm. Let's think on that a minute. Maybe I put it over here, dig it into the side of the hill on this side, maybe. Mm. Tell you what, I'm going to think on it a minute and then get back to you guys. Be right back. All right, so uh, let's see. I uh, put up this janky double wall because I really don't want the wolves to eat my sheep. Put in a bit of bit some leaves here so they can't get in on top of the wall. Um, what else did I do? It's just a short break. Oh yeah, got me a handy dandy pocket fisherman. This is a Sweeney Dunstan design. And uh, I think I'm probably going to go ahead and call this an episode for now. It's it's quite jumbled, I know. And this place, I didn't realize it until I started thinking about recording. It's like, this is janky, janky, janky. I, I must do something about this. So I'll see what I can do in between episodes. But uh, in the meantime, I hope you guys have a great day. And I hope to see y'all in the next episode. Via con Dios, amigos.